Cat's Cradle here. Just going to make a short video about something that has concerned me for a long time. I was raised on the Texas Gulf Coast where hurricanes were a frequent occurrence. We always had a television and radio to give us plenty of warning so we knew that was coming. I moved to the Midwest about 12 years ago and for the first time had to face the reality that Tornadoes are just a way of life here. They, especially during the spring and summer months, uh, there are frequent tornado warnings. And as I began, began this preparedness lifestyle of just having my family ready for any eventual, eventuality, um, I was concerned as to what would happen if, for some reason, uh, radio and television were not available to me. Now that sounds kind of silly because it's always been there for us, but the thing you need to ask yourself is could that happen? Could it happen that you not have a radio available, available in the event of an emergency or that the television was not available? It could happen and I thought how in the world would I know that that there was a tornado, a chance of tornadoes. How would I know that? Would I just be unprepared and it come upon me suddenly? Uh, I can't imagine what people did in the olden days. They probably kept their eyes uh, glued on the horizon. They probably watched those kind of things way more than we watched them. So I thought, is there anything I could do to protect my family a little bit? And as I thought of it, I thought, uh, and I wasn't really familiar with this and not even really sure what it's, what it's called, but I call it my little weather station. Uh, I bought it, I found it probably about a year ago as I began thinking about this because I knew that, that I had seen a long time ago on my great-grandfather's wall something that looked very similar. And I knew that, uh, that one of the little gauges told you what the temperature was and one of them told you what the humidity was and he might have even had a clock on his and then there is this part right here and you probably cannot I don't even know if I can get it to focus in but I'll try this up here says change fair very dry stormy rain and the little needle, like, uh, this is a needle I can put on, like, where it is today, and then I can see how it, ch how it changes. But right now, the needle is in between change and fair. So, uh, what that tells me is I'm probably going to have a pretty nice day, and it may get a little cloudy, but rain is probably not expected. I have checked this dial when the weather has gotten bad, and it does move over to stormy and I would assume that if it pegs out right down here that we're probably in trouble. So I do check this thing just to see what they're saying on the news and if it how it translates to this little dial and it's pretty darn accurate. Down here this tells me that the humidity today uh, of course it's in the house right now but it says it's like at about uh, 57 57 percent humidity and it says the temperature of course, this just came in from the garage. It's about 75 degrees, and that is that is pretty accurate. I do keep this uh, in the garage right by my back door. I do check it. I try to check it when I come in the door if I've been out just to see if, if I'm feeling that it's pretty accurate. But this gives me a degree of, of peace that I wouldn't have if I didn't have access to television and radio. At least I could check this thing and see if the weather is about to get stormy or the weather is about to get bad. Uh, I can also check to see if there's been a dramatic temperature change. Uh, when, I, when I decided I wanted to find one of these, I went on eBay and was about to order one because they have tons of them for sale on eBay. I guess it's the kind of thing they sell a lot at estate sales. Um, and, and things like that. So there, there's a lot of them on eBay if you want one. But I happen to be, I live in a, a little tiny town and we have a resale shop here. And I went in the resale shop and I couldn't believe it. 
uh, the people there thought I was crazy because I just squealed when I saw this thing, and they had it marked $3, and I was thrilled to get it and brought it home. It's in great shape. Um, somebody just, you know, got rid of it and didn't think it was anything they needed, and it was certainly something I needed. So uh, I'm just throwing this out there for you. Uh, how would you how would you know about a dramatic weather change that was coming if you didn't have access to radio and television? This is just a tool I thought I could use, and maybe it gives you uh, an idea as well. You can pick them up pretty cheaply. Uh, you might want to consider it. Cat's Cradle.